Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I hope you're all doing well and having a fantastic weekend. Today, we will be covering more recent cases that shows the ridiculous advantages good looks give you in life and the opposite, how being unattractive negatively affects you. I have four new cases, two criminally related and two Hollywood related. I have many more videos of pretty privilege on my channel that you guys can check out. Small disclaimer, I do not condone or encourage the evil actions done by these killers in the video. All support goes out to the families of the victims. Thank you. If you want to support the channel and get your face evaluated by me with personalized look max and advice, link will be down in the description. If you want to read more about topics like these, you can check out my blog at nearfacerating.com. Without further ado, let's get this video started. So, starting with the first case, a famous rapper named Folio was murdered in cold blood during his birthday celebration party in Tampa, Florida in the United States. The images of the killers online are very rare to find and are private, but I managed to find some on TikTok. Here they are, you can definitely see that objectively the killer is good looking. Here is how women reacted to him, I'm gonna read you some of the comments. He looks too effing good. He is fine. I know he might be innocent you all. Free you, he did nothing your honor. And you have CG calling them out on the comments. Who this? Now you're sure he's the right guy and he's innocent. And to rub salt on the wound even further, here is a video reaction to the killer's face. Moving on to the second case. This case I have already covered last week of the killer Wade Wilson. To keep things short, he killed two women in cold blood and women all over the internet were simping over him even though knowing the heinous acts he did. He's still for women a more suitable dating option than you. This is an update on what has been happening on TikTok since the case has become more and more popular gaining traction. A petition was put up and signed more than 3,000 times. So I thought this was Cap. I thought they were doing this as like some sort of weird, dark comedy type of thing. No, not at all. Prevent the death penalty for Wade Wilson petition. They got 3,300 signatures already. The fact that these people exist gives my soul a migraine. And before I wish them infected hemorrhoids, because I'm gonna do that, let's see what they have to say here. Everyone deserves a chance for the right help and a chance to be loved. You are an awful person. I wish you all the hemorrhoids. All of them! Let God be the one to judge. Yes, let's send him to God right now. He might have done something bad, but two wrongs don't make a right. It's not about wrong and right. It's about taking monsters off our planet. I believe he deserves another opportunity. To what? To what? Let him live in your house then. Have y'all noticed a theme yet? Every single one of those were women's names. In fact, all of them were women's names except for one. And that one is old Remus. Remus said he don't deserve the died. Only God will judge. Instead, God herself made much crime. Let him free. Holy shit, it has the dumb. But yeah, a whole bunch of thirsty ass desperate women who think he's hot and old mental midget Remus think that Wade Wilson needs a second chance. So moving on to the less dark but still sad cases. In the latest play of Romeo and Juliet done by Tom Holland and the actress Francesca, she received lots of hate and trolling due to her appearance and her looks. Here are some of the comments on screen for you to read when you pause the video. And for the final case, it's an interesting case of how actors look in Hollywood determine the role they play. This is related to the halo and horn effects. In the latest popular release of Netflix Baby Reindeer, the star of the show was given the role of a stalker due to her looks, again related to the halo and horn effects. You are judged by how you look. If she was more attractive, another role would have been assigned to her. But what do you guys think about all of this? Let me know your thoughts down in the comment section. That's it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. A like and subscribe will be highly appreciated. And like usual, catch you guys in the next one.